Yes guys and welcome back to yet another video on the channel today like I said I am going to be recording the 532 formation that's right very similar to the 5212 formation in which I did yesterday um, but this formation is slightly um, slightly more defensive this formation had a cam and two box to box and submits in this formation it has three sentiments meaning you can attack you can defend as a unit so a very good formation and I want you guys to exploit it and tell me what you think. Before we start though, if you are new here, it would be greatly appreciated if you can subscribe, especially if you are returning to the channel, as especially um, because you're watching these videos again. Spread this videos or these videos to more people like you who need this help. So, without further ado, let's get into the tactics for this 451 formation. So, let's get into the tactics now. Oh, these, these are not the tactics, by the way, guys. These are the 5212 tactics, actually. So, make sure you, you, make sure you use these if you do want to use the 5212 formation. So, with our defensive star starting off, we are going to use the balance. With our width, though, we are going to use 4 and 4. Now, with the 5212, you previously, previously just saw, we did use 6 and 6 because it's much more attacking. Now, I do not like to use 5 and 5. For me, you either go attacking or you go balance, which is 4 and 4. For me, 4 and 4 is perfect with this formation, defending as a unit and making it difficult for them to cut a pass through us or run in behind us. With our offensive star, we are going to use the... Um, a fast build up again, similar to the 5212 um, formation, really. I use fast build up on that with five backs the 532 and 5212. Like I said, the only ones you want to be using, you do want to play the fast build up style because you've got a lot of men through the center of the pitch. You want to play quick tiki taka football like Prime Barcelona, one twos for our center mids, our strikers to our wing backs, sometimes even to our center halves. And yeah, fast build up is definitely going to help you um, with this formation. With our width, though, we are going to use 5 now. Um, we play the way the formation wants us to play, if you get that. We do uh, not want to go too wide, otherwise our strikers will go too wide. Our centre mids, uh, there'll be nobody through the centre. And if we go too narrow, again, we do sometimes need a player out wide. We do need our wing backs to hold that touchline and whip balls in for our striker to feed off of. Players in the box will be 5 again. Um, again, we do want to get two of our box to box sentiments in there. Do not get all three. Otherwise, you may as well be playing that 5 3 uh, 5 2 1 2 formation. With this, though, we have three sentiments you have to utilize uh, with the instructions who gets in there and who does not. And I'll show you the best instructions for that in a second. Corners three and three kicks two. Again, I said this last video. I previously used um, one of my free kicks, but now I use two because I sometimes had a free kick in a wide position, as you can see here on the game hut menu. Um, when you have a free kick in a wide position, there's nobody um, ever to pass the ball in there, nobody to put the ball into, and it's very, very annoying when you only have like two players in there. So now I use two. Again, the 5 3 2 formation, like I said, then wing back is going to provide that width. We've got a lot of players through the center, so we're going to overload that middle of the pitch and basically dominate them through there. With our instructions, though, we will use stay central, stay forward, and get in behind. Important that you do use these instructions on your strikers. Um, you definitely want stay central on them because your wing backs, there's absolutely zero point in your wing backs. Um, being wingbacks if you have balance width on your strikers because they're never ever ever they're going to get wide um your wingbacks will not have a role so we're going to use stay central on them a box of box center is going to have cover center and get into box of cross and that's going to be our central center midfielder with our others though we will use cover center like i just said we do want our two of our center mids staying back whilst one of them gets into the box and as you can see here our central center midfielder will be getting into that box with our left center mid and right center mid just edging a bit backwards with our centre half, though, we do use default, default, wing backs, default, default, default again. Um, you do not want to use stay back while attacking on your wing backs, otherwise, what's the point in playing a five at the back? And you especially do not want to do join the attack, otherwise, you're turning into the three five two formation, um, which not is that it's not. It's not really that good, guys. Um, this 5-3-2 is definitely, definitely better because not only can you attack nicely, you can also defend as a unit, so it's very, very useful. So guys, that is going to be the 5-3-2 formation, however, I need to show you my goalkeeper first, comes crosses and sweeper keeper, same as always, guys. So like I said, the 5-3-2 formation here, um, comment down below what formation you would like to see next, because I will definitely, definitely do that for you. Also, have a nice day, have a nice week, and goodbye, and don't forget, subscribe.